Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me for our daily Oracle and Tarot card reading. And this reading is going to be for Wednesday, April the 8th, and we will be using the Fairy Oracle by Lucy Cavendish. And as I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, God, and angels, please deliver the message to me so I may, I may share it for my viewers and as well for the highest good of all. And we have the Unicorn and the Maiden. Carry Me Home. And Crystal Magic. Okay, let's get started. So for Wednesday, the message that we're getting, first of all, with the Unicorn and the Maiden. The Unicorn and the Maiden, communication with Unicorn, purification, undercover action. Very interesting. She's beautiful, reddish, blonde hair. She's holding on to this unicorn. He has beautiful roses up here. The sun is bursting in the sky. It's a, a beautiful orange, red, fiery feel to it. Purification, undercover action. Undercover action. What I get from spirit when I think of this, when I think of undercover action, it, it's some steps that we may have to take on our own. It's undercover. It's not exposed. It's not public. It's something that we need to do for ourselves, but no one needs to know about it. It's something that you do. It's, when, when I think of purification, it's, it's basically to gather your grounding, gather your, your thoughts, to remove the negativity, to, to purify your mind. Very interesting card. Let's see what the other cards have to say. And then the second one is Carry Me Home. And this card here, it's saying support, time to be carried, allow others to help. Fairy is leaning on a male fairy. And there's a beautiful moon in the background. And whenever I see the moon, I think of releasing, releasing the old, letting go of the old. Because if you don't let go of the old, you're not going to be able to welcome in any of the new. you got to make room for it in your life. You know, just the, uh, the letting go card of, of yesterday. And then, you know, asking for someone's support. You know, from the angelic realm, someone that you trust that will, you know, keep your your conversation and confidence. And this one, carry me home. Uh, allow others to help. Again, you're leaning on someone. You're not trying to get over whatever it is that you're trying to leave behind by yourself. The burden is too hard to carry on your own. And it's not necessary to bear it on your own. People will help you. People will be there as long as you ask them to be. Nobody's a mind reader. Nobody wants to intervene or seem like they're nosy or, or meddling in your business. Some people are just standing there waiting for you to ask for their assistance. And then the third card is Crystal Magic. And the Crystal Magic card says, Creation, Dawn, the Beginning. And there's all these beautiful, beautiful purple crystals. She's in a beautiful flowing gown. She's looking upward. She's not sulking. She's not feeling bad. Otherwise, her head would be downward. She's looking up towards the heavens. Creation, dawn, the beginning. And I happen to have my amethyst right here, which goes lovely with this picture. <laughs> As you can see, you know, it matches up with the card. And uh, when I think of creation, I think of, I think of reinventing oneself. That's what I get from spirit. Creation in the beginning. The beginning. You can't have a beginning if you don't leave behind what needs to end in your life. Something has to end in order for something to begin it. We have to get rid of the old to make room for the new. And this is a very exciting card. We're going in the right direction. We're definitely going in the right direction this Wednesday. And this is telling us the beginning, creation, dawn. When I think of dawn, and you could vaguely see like the sun or daylight here, you think of a fresh new day, a fresh new start. It doesn't have to be scary to leave old things behind. 
It doesn't have to be scary to move on from a relationship that's not working. It doesn't have to be scary leaving a job that's unfulfilling. Leaving friends behind that no longer have your best interest at heart. Because when you get rid of all of those toxic situations and unhealthy relationships and codependent relationships, you make way for a new dawn, a new beginning. If you've enjoyed this message, please subscribe to my channel because I'll be back tomorrow. Take care.